Hi and hello, I am Athena Pondin here. In this episode, what we are going to see about is regarding a Smart India Hackathon because already we saw in the previous video Smart India Hackathon, what is SIH, that is Smart India Hackathon, what is happening in the SIH, everything we saw already. In this episode, what I am going to say is, uh, say I am going to say some of the important numbers regarding this SIH 2020 years. The portal, that is uh, the proposal submission portal is open for uh, SIH 2020. So regarding that, we are, I'm going to say some of the important dates and the eligibility criteria and how many numbers of softwares and hardware problem statement each and everything we are going to see in this video. Come, let's see. Smart India Hackathon 2020 portal is open for the students because already most of the sector members are uh, uh, submitted their problem statement to the SIH and the SIH team members are finalized and list out some of the problem statement. So this, the portal is open for the students. Their students are prepared. Those who are willing to participate, they need to find out the solutions of any of the problem that is list out in the SIH. In this year, that is in this 2020, in this uh, SIH 2020, totally 11 sectors are participating. That is 11 sectors are submitted already their uh, uh, problem statement to the SIH. Total problem statement is count is around 224, that exactly 224. In that 182 are the software problem statement and the 42 are the hardware software, hardware problem statement. So the total count is 192 plus 42 is 224 problem statements are uh, submitted to the uh, SIH portal 2020. So the students, those who are coming under the All India Council for Technical Education, that is AICTE, those students are need to find out the solution for this particular 224 problem statement. The count is okay. The conditions we need to follow because uh, SIH 2020 senior officials, they are framing some of the conditions uh, uh, the particular institution need to follow. In that, the first condition is that your institution or college should come in under AICTE. This is the first condition. The second condition is that uh, uh, from the institution, each and every institution, they are going to pick only seven teams. Seven teams are eligible to participating in the SIH from one institution. In that seven team, the five teams should be find out in the solution for, they are submitting the proposal for software problem statement and the two teams should be submitting the proposal for hard, uh, hardware statement, uh, pro, hardware problem statement. So five plus two, seven teams are eligible to participating in this SIH from single institution. And then the next condition is that uh, among the seven team, among the seven team, each and every team should have at least a six members should there. In that six members, one female candidate should be participated, not the seven, uh, whole seven, six members or uh, um, uh, gents are not allowed, one at least a minimum of single girl candidate should be participated in a single team and the seven teams should be participated from the institution, this is the second condition. Then the third condition is that uh, students are not supposed to register directly to the uh, SIH portal through the single point of contact member through only you can able to register single point of contact is nothing but SPOCs. So already SIH uh, senior officials, they are appointed uh, uh, SPOCs to each and every institution. So each and every institution have SPOCs. Through the SPOCs only, you are going to register your proposal and every team uh, team names and team numbers and team uh, uh, registration proposal and everything should be registered through the SPOCs only, not in person. Now I'm going to say some of the important dates for the SIH 2020. Already the portal is open for uh, registration from the December 1, 2019 itself it is open and it is closed on uh, January 25th, 2020. So on or before through the SPOCs, uh, students need to submit their uh, proposal to the uh, SIH portal. And then the next important date is uh, uh, we have the hardware and the software competition uh, separately. So for the software competition it will be held in uh, tentatively they are announcing the date that is a March 14 or uh, March 14 and the 15 the, the competition will be happen for the software uh, software problem statement and for the hardware problem statement the date will be uh, uh, from uh, July 6 to 10 2020. So this is the tentative date actually for the software it is March and for the hardware it is July. So it is a tentative date, the dates may be changed later on. And then important announcement is that uh, uh, each and every already I said uh, only the seven teams are eligible to participate in this SIH 2020. 
So, uh, each and every uh, institution uh, felt very difficult to find out the seven important team. So, for that, they suggested that is SIA suggested that need to contact some of the small level of hackathon. So, uh, SPOCs make a point of this. So, you need to submit your uh, small level of hackathon proofs to the uh, SIH 2020 while you are registering for the students. The proof of the small, small level of hackathon that has happened in the college should be submitted. So, this is the conditions and this is the dates for this Smart India hackathon. Important announcement for the biomedical engineering students because uh, totally we already saw that uh, 224 problem statements are submitted to the SIH 2020. In that uh, 21 proposal, that is 121 uh, problem statements are healthcare based. So uh, all the biomedical engineering students and the healthcare related peoples, you need to submit it, you need to find out the solution for 21 problems. In that 16 are the software problem statement and the 5 are the hardware problem statement. So each and every biomedical students you need to participate to find out the solution for this 21 healthcare issues. Solution for the 21 problem statements submitted by different uh, healthcare units uh, in the different healthcare sector includes uh, uh, Bajaj, G Healthcare, then uh, the healthcare sector from the different state government and the central government that is Ministry of Human Resource Development also they are submitting some of the healthcare uh, uh, proposal to the uh, SIH. So, we need to find out the 21 problem statement. We have 21 problem statement. We need to find out the solution for that 21 problem statement. Pick any one and submit the solution and submit, give your idea uh, selected from the uh, uh, college and participating and win the competition. So, that's all about this episode of SIS 2020. So, each and every dates and the counts and the numbers I already told you. So, students. Uh, rush towards to participate in this competition and all the best to win the competition. Thank you.